Frop Dad here, cosplay for us all. I am working on a plasma pistol for Halo and uh, was getting ready to do some routing on here. It's like, you know what, we should shoot some, shoot some video and uh, show what we're doing here. So I've taken two half inch pieces of MDF and sorry, I'm a little nervous because this is going to be <laughs> all this work I've done and I'm getting ready to kind of tear it up. Um, now, as you see, I've got two halves here. Inside are going to be wiring, electronics, triggers, things like that. And I've got these holes set for these screws, these Allen head screws. I've got four of these set up here. But I got to thinking, you know, even though you've got the screws, you've got the holes, everything should line up, it still might not line up perfectly. So what I did was, got a little dowel rod, got it right here. And I. I got these screwed together to where they should be. I drilled holes, uh, three different holes, all the way through this piece and about halfway through the interior piece. You see these holes here and kind of routed those out inside just a hair and you'll see those are sticking through there. So now uh, after we cast this, it will go together just like that. You see it just goes in the same spot every single time same spot and then the customer will be able to put their screws in um, now what I'm getting ready to do here as you can see I've got some lines drawn out I still got to go around these holes and whatnot but I have a drill press set up over here and well, one thing here I know I had the these sticking out of course I'm gonna cut these off and make those smooth so it'll be the same height but I've got this drill press here I have a router bit on here and we are going to route out the inside and make this hollow. So the two halves will be hollow. Hello! <laughs> and we'll be able to <laughs> hold the wiring, hold a trigger, hold a switch, batteries, and all that stuff. Uh, we'll have some, uh, some type of acrylic up here for the plasma. It's going to be green and, and glowing. Some LEDs in there for that. And I'm using a drill press, although you really shouldn't for routing. But uh, I do have a router. But it's such a high RPM, I'm afraid that I'll be like, you know, going and just totally ruin it. So um, that's what we were doing today. Always wear your safety gear, especially when working with MDF. It's very dusty. Okay, here are the pieces after they've been routed out. And as you see, plenty of room in there. I'll be able to put a uh, battery pack in there. Also wanted to point out, I didn't show earlier, uh, the I found these little brass inserts. And that's how the hex head uh, screws are, able to go, are going to be able to uh, keep the two halves together. And here it is, screwed back together. Nobody knows that it's hollow except for you and me. And it's quite a bit lighter too. It's another reason for doing that. Not only the internal parts, but it will make it lighter and easier to carry around. 